What's up people today I'm going to show you how you can export super wide screen 21 by 9 videos from Adobe Premiere. Now as you all know most of the videos that we watch or make these days are actually widescreen 16 by 9 videos and the movies are actually shot in super widescreen ratio. And a lot of us just like to crop our videos from the top and the bottom to give it a bit of cinematic look and that looks great. But the problem is that a lot of us just end up rendering our videos as normal 16 by 9 videos and what that does is that uh, those black bars become a part of your video. They are saved as a part of your video frame. So if you play that video on a normal screen, it's going to look good. But if someone plays that on an actual 21 by 9 super wide screen TV or monitor, it's going to look terrible. And to fix that, today I'm going to show you how you can export your video as an actual 21 by 9 video uh, without the black bars. So I'm going to drag and drop this video here. I shot this video a few days ago without any reason. And then we're going to need an adjustment layer. So uh, just right click on your project panel and click on new item and click on adjustment layer. Hit OK. And there's your adjustment layer. Just drag it above your original video. Then stretch it out. And now we're going to work on the adjustment layer. Always work on the adjustment layer, never on the original video. So, first thing we're going to do is we're going to apply the crop effect. So, just go to the effects panel, click here, and go to effects and search for crop. And then just drag and drop the crop onto the adjustment layer. All right. Then Go to the effects control panel right here. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to crop the video 12% from the top and 12% from the bottom. Now, 12% is not exactly what movies are being shot in. Because movies are being shot in uh, 2.39 by 1 ratio. And 12% is going to give you somewhere around 2.35 by 1 to 2.39 by 1. So if you want to be really exact, you got to do a little bit of mathematics or you can download some templates from the internet. But generally, if you want supervised screen 21 by 9 videos, you can crop 12% from the top and 12% from the bottom. So after cropping, you get the opportunity to move your video up and down a little bit if your subject is not in the center. So select your video this time and go to effects panel and click on motion. And then you can scale it. Uh, or move it up and down like that to make sure your subject is in the center. Uh, all right, so adjust that. And then we come to the final part of exporting it as a super widescreen video. So just click on File and click on Export and click on Media. All right, now as you can see, if I click on Export right now, it's going to export this video as a 16 by 9 video. With these black bars as a part of the frame. So we're going to fix that. We're going to go to Source tab right here and then click on this uh, Crop Video tool. Click on that and then we're going to crop out those black bars and we're going to make sure that we only select the actual video footage, not those black bars. All right, make sure it's really exact and then go to your output tab again and click on source scaling and click on change output size to match source and bingo that's what i was talking about as you can see those black bars are gone now before you move on let me tell you one thing that 21 by 9 or super wide screen ratio is not supported by all the formats so if you have selected like H.264 or uh, AVI or something like that, maybe you're not going to be able to export your video as a super widescreen video because that format doesn't allow it. So make sure you have some uh, 4K video format like MKV or something and that's going to work really good. But if you have like wrong format, you're, gonna not, you're not going to have this option right here. So make sure you have the right format for that. All right, so once you've done that, just click on export. And it's going to export the video. And 
then I'll show you the video. And there you go. That's the video I was talking about. Now, if I play this video for you, you will see that if I play it on full screen, it's going to have the black bars. And if I scale it down, you can see the black bars are not a part of the video frame. Alright, so ladies and gentlemen, that is how you export a super widescreen 21 by 9 video from Adobe Premiere. That's it for today. Thanks a lot for watching and have a great day.